The aortic valve is the last valve in the heart before blood is delivered to the rest of the body. The aortic valve sits right at the top of the heart between the left ventricle and the aorta. In fact, the aortic valve sits inside the aorta. It's suspended like a suspension bridge within that aorta structure. And the valve is made up usually of three leaflets or cusps. And so what that means is when the heart beats, the valve pops open and blood rushes into the aorta. And when the heart fills, the valve closes and seals so that blood flow doesn't go backwards into the heart. Somewhere between one and a half and 2% of the population is born with an abnormally shaped aortic valve, what we call a bicuspid aortic valve. What does that mean? Well, first of all, let me show you what a normal tricuspid aortic valve looks like on end. That aorta is shaped sort of like a three-leaf clover in most people. And inside there are those three leaflets that are suspended inside the aorta. But in folks who have a bicuspid aortic valve, we see that their aorta is shaped a little bit differently. And they have two leaflets that open and close between the left ventricle and the aorta. And a lot of times, it looks like that valve was trying to be a three leaflet valve in utero, but it never actually uh, formed properly. It's not always a problem to have a bicuspid aortic valve, but we know that bicuspid aortic valves are prone to fail in one of a few different ways and sometimes requires an operation.